starts now. Good evening, I'm Renee Cooper. Thanks for joining us for KX News. Leading the news tonight, the people of Lincoln are frustrated after a boil water alert issued yesterday afternoon. Thursday, the city's residents said the water was cloudy and discolored and told several, to several told KX News they felt like it was not drinkable. City officials said they tested the water every day and at that point it was safe to consume despite its appearance. Friday, the city engineer said the same thing, quote, the water is safe, but we understand that it's not as pristine as they're used to seeing. Then, Saturday, after a positive test for a bacteria called coliform, Mayor Gerald Wise issued a boil water alert. Residents reacted with anger and frustration in the more than 70 comments on the mayor's Facebook Live, announcing the alert around 4 o'clock. This comes after the city was without water in late November due to a water main break. Now, KX News is putting North Dakota first. Today, we did some digging into what this bacteria, the city's new water supply, is and how serious it might be. Check out this chart from the Washington State Department of Health. Now, the CDC says most coliform bacteria are a natural part of the environment that are found in plant material, water, and soil. They do not cause disease, but they do indicate the water may be contaminated by soil or feces, meaning a waterborne disease may be present. Now, some rare types of coliforms like E. coli, this strain noted by that orange dot, can cause serious illness, although, according to the CDC, most of these outbreaks are from eating undercooked food. Cases from contaminated drinking water are possible, but they are rare. And as we reported yesterday, if you live in the city of Lincoln, continue to boil your water until further notice. For more information, head over to our website, kxnet.com.